This is Diana from Profile Sports, and today we're going to show you how you can have a beautiful bio page like this to send to college recruiters. This up here is your dedicated URL, and it will be your name here, and this is exactly the page recruiters will land on. They won't have to find you anywhere or do any searches. This is exactly the page that will show up when recruiters click on the link that you will insert into your letter of interest. It has your physicality all filled out and your biography that we're going to help you write. Today, what we're concerned about is how do we get this nice image in here. So first, we're going to log in to the website. You may have gotten here from one of our banner ads or directly from the ProfileSportsApp.com web page on the registration tab. Now you've probably already created a username and password, but in case you have not, we'll walk you through those steps right now. It's going to ask you to go to your email and confirm your account, and then you'll have to create your password. And do keep your password for future updates. If you want to change your photo or change the wording on your bio page, this is a living document, so it's yours to add to and edit anytime you like. The first time you'll go here, you're going to have a pretty blank looking page like this one. To edit your bio page, you go back to the main menu by selecting account. You can update it at any time. It will have your name and your email address, but nothing else on the form will be filled out. You can go down and fill in as much information as you know. And yes, you do want to put in your weight. Coaches need to know. You select your school. This is where the logo from your school is entered in, and we will handle that for you. Selecting Next takes you to the next form field, but doesn't save. If your school is not pre-populated, don't worry about it. We will contact you and have it added. Don't worry about all this right now, this bio section, because we'll walk you through that step by step. I just want to show you here that allowing people to follow you and being found in public is set to no right now. Just because while you're building your bio page, you don't want it to be shown halfway developed. So for now, we're just going to leave these as no, and we're going to simply update your primary photo. Now you can get to the Upload Your Photo page a couple of different ways. You can get there by clicking on this button, or by going back up to Account. Select that, which takes you back to the main menu. And then simply click on Add Your Photo right here, Update an Image, I'm going to look for an image here. I'm going to use Janae's image right here. We'll pop her in there. She's going to be my model for the day. Now, while this is updating, here's some important information. What we want is to make sure that the image you select is of high resolution because it has to be at least 500 pixels wide in order to use. If you select a lower resolution image than that, you're going to end up with a pixelated, low quality looking bio page. You might have noticed that the bio page is horizontal, where most portraits come in vertical. So it's going to be important to crop it, and we're ready to crop it instantly with this little X. Just line up here and select the area that we want. We can even reposition it until we're happy. And we simply go save the image, and there she is ready to go. So now you'll want to set these two green buttons to yes to publish your bio page. Remembering to save at the lower right hand corner of the form. Main menu by hitting account and let's take a look at the finished bio page. Voila! There you are. And that's as easy as it is to create your own profile bio page. Thank you for listening 
and we'll talk to you soon on the next installment of Tips and Tricks from Profile Sports.